Miss me? That's right, after a nice little vacation, the Hawkeroo has come back to you. A lot has happened since I left, I'm sure, but I wasn't paying any attention, I was on vacation, bitches. I did find out about Joe Cowley though, and I have to tell you, I'm pretty pissed off about it all. Not at Cowley for what he said, or at Cowley for deleting his account, no, I'm pissed off at you. First of all, you are all out there pretending that Joe didn't treat men the exact same way on Twitter. Treating men and women the same way doesn't make you a sexist, it just makes you an asshole in Joe's case. Second of all, you are all a bunch of fucking hypocrites. I was sitting in my hotel room the other night with a Colombian prostitute recommended to me by a friend in the Secret Service when the show Louis came on. Louis C.K. is a comedian you all love. You think he's the funniest fucking man in the world. During this episode, Louis C.K. called a woman in the audience at his show a cunt repeatedly. He called her a cunt, her mother a cunt, and said he wished the cunt never came out of her cunt mother's cunt. Louis C.K. is also known to call people fags all the time during his routine. This doesn't bother any of you. You love him anyway, so it's cool for Louis C.K. to call a woman a cunt repeatedly, but if Joe Cowley makes a joke about a woman pilot needing directions, he's a giant asshole who must be stopped, really? And you feel this way because Deadspin wrote about it, a fucking blog that got famous for posting a picture of Brett Favre's dick and posted video of a girl being raped in a bathroom stall? This is your new beacon of morality? I won't even get into the kid who told Deadspin Joe got him fired from the Chicago Sun-Times, yet offered no proof that Joe did, just his opinion. You're all a bunch of fucking hypocrites, I don't agree with 95% of the shit Joe Cowley says or writes, and neither do you. The difference between me and you though is that I'm not a fucking idiot. Just because I don't agree with somebody doesn't mean I'm going to automatically hate them, for you, though, that's exactly what it means. So since you didn't agree with Joe Cowley, you hated him, when you know damn well that if Lou E. C. K. had been tweeting the same fucking things, you'd have thought he was some sort of goddamn genius. Not too long ago you assholes were all over Twitter screaming stop SOPA. You were afraid the government was going to take away your internet and your right to freedom of speech and all this other bullshit. But the second you have a chance to take away somebody else's freedom of speech? Oh you assholes can't fucking wait for the moment that happens. Swarming on it like flies to shit. Joe Cowley may in fact be an asshole, but so are each and every one of you who celebrated him deleting his account and saying you hoped he would get fired. A bunch of hypocritical, douchebag assholes. So I say to you. With all the love in my heart, go fuck yourself. See you next week.